up, this is Insanity, and today we're gonna to be learning a little footwork move called a knee rock. And there's a bunch of different types of knee rocks. This is just one, a simple one with our knees and our feet together. Um, before we start, I wanted to talk a little bit about knee pads. Um, these are something that's definitely helpful in the longevity of your knees. In, in break dancing, we tend to hit our knees on the ground, bump them, and once in a while it's fine, but over time, you tend to get bruises and bruises um, eventually become like water uh, in your knees and it, it sticks in there and um, eventually it can get infected. It's just not a very pretty thing. So you wanna make sure you have uh, some type of protection on your knees, especially if you're doing moves that involve your knees hitting the ground. Um, not Again, not everybody does moves with uh, your knees hitting the ground. So if you do, then invest in one of these. These are just volleyball knee pads. Uh, this brand is Mikasa, you can get it. Uh, a Nike brand, um, pretty much any sports store will carry these. All right, so to start off um, with the technique of this, we're not literally slamming our knees into the ground. When we land, we land on our foot and then our knee. So it kind of absorbs the impact, right? Versus if I was just to go like that, that might hurt a little bit. This kind of absorbs the impact by going foot and knee. All right, so that's the basic technique. We're gonna start off uh, in this position on our toes and our hand. Basically, keeping our feet and our knees together. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lean my weight onto my hand, I'm gonna turn, I'm gonna land right here on my knees. I'm gonna switch hands, I'm gonna turn back, back to my feet. Let's do that again. I'm gonna put my weight onto my arm, jump to my knees, hand down, back to my feet. So it goes knees, feet, knees, feet, knees, feet, knees, feet. Right? And you could also do that in um, different patterns and different sequences. You go knees, knees, feet, knees, feet, knees, feet. In order to do that, every time you put your knees down, you're gonna turn another direction. So instead of going facing this way, like this, when I put my knees down, I'm gonna face this way. Knees. And now, in order to make myself go in a circle, now I'm gonna turn and face the back wall. Put my hand down, I go again, put my hands down, I'm gonna face this way. Knees, back to the front, feet. To go the opposite direction, it's basically the opposite motion. Knees, feet, knees, feet. Knees, feet, knees, feet. All right, going all the way in a circle. You can create your own pattern. You don't necessarily have to do four, you can do three, you can do any, any number of these in a circle that you like. All right, again, take your time on this. I don't wanna see you guys with big old bruises or bumps on your knees. So take your time, take care of your knees. And again, like always, take this, play with it, get creative. All right, hope you guys enjoy. Peace out.